In this lesson, we will cover the retrieve record and how to pass the column names. Remember that this is not the column name. We have to pass this name. This is the display name. So when we are passing, for example, facts, we should pass a small f facts. If we are passing this, my column, then we should pass this CR76A underscore my column 1. So, let's go back to our solution. Apps. Edit and we run it. New retrieve record. Before that, we press F twelve. Clear the console. Retrieve record. So, you see, this is not the right name. The right name is small m column. Okay. So, we will go back. And here under accounts, instead of doing that, we don't need this. So back to solution, we go to the web resource. Edit. Now, my retrieve record JavaScript 2. My retrieve record JavaScript 2. Select name, comma, facts. Small f. Name, comma, facts. So, we upload another file. Save. La, 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 la. Publish. Let's let's edit. Quickly see the content. This looks okay. So cancel apps. Let's leave that as is. Control F5. We don't need this anymore. We can leave it. New. Retrieve record. Where is F12? Clear console. One more time. Retrieve record. Facts 1, 2, 3, 4, 3. Whereas here, the facts number is. Let me put my facts number 416-809-0979. That used to be my facts number. Now, Clear console. Retrieve record. There you go. You got this number here. Now, we had a custom column CR76, my column 1. 
this did not work in the previous demo because I was feeling so sleepy that I could hardly do anything. <laughs> my column one, my column one. Oh, my column one. Now we save this. Anybody? Anybody? Web resource. Edit. Upload the file. Save. Publish. Publish succeeded. Control F5. Retrieve record. My column one is null. Why? Oh, we don't have that in the form. So we go to the apps. Okay, we change it from the forms. This looks okay. Data. Edit record. Here it is null. Save. ASDG. Got it? So we have to match the uh, JavaScript code which is here this value must match this column this one so if I expand it a bit my column one this is how you get the name and then you put it in this in the upload file and it reflects in the code here 
So that's about retrieving record with the proper name of the field. Not use the display name, but the name of the field. Which is this, here it says, name. That's it about this lesson.